And we continue learning Mesilas Yisharim Yoimi with this wonderful Hachzik program, continuing learning about Anava on page 458 in the art school Mesilas Yisharim. Continues the Ramchal going to the third category of Anava. Yesterday we spoke about bearing insult. Now continues the Ramchal, Sinas the Rabban is a brichus like Avoid, hating uh, positions of authority. It doesn't mean hating the Rabban and God forbid. Hating the positions of authority and a brichus like Avoid and running from honor. Mishnah Aruchi says that the Ramchal, so Mishnah Bergi Avois, Oyeva Samalacha, which love to work, Usnas Rabbanus, and he should detest. The authority, the position of authority of Amraid, says the Mishnah there further, Hagas Libai Bahira. One who's a Gas Libai, one who's haughty, he's the one that paskins. Shaita Rush of a Gas Ruach is foolish, is wicked, and he's arrogant. Vamru and continues to go on Irvin. Kolaroide of Akar HaKavod, you run after Kavod. HaKavod by Reach Mimanu, the Kavod is going to run away. From you. Continues the Ramchal with more Makaris. Vamru Oyd says the Medjish Psikta Rabasi. Al Tate the Raiv Maher. The Pasuk Mishnah says, Do not be quick to enter into the Raiv, which means a fight, a Rav, strife. But we also can learn it as a Rav. Don't be quick to become a master. Laila Malite Rats. Achra Ashrar, you should never run after position of prominence. Lama Penta Seb Achra Yusuf. Why? What's the reason? Because see what's going to be at the end when someone humiliates you. So you're going to ask you questions. What are you going to answer? We see furthermore. Whoever accepts the positions of authority in order for personal benefit, he doesn't really want to help the people. He does it for himself. He's like an adulterer. You see what we're comparing someone who takes a position of authority not for the right purposes. He's like a noyev, one who's mizana, that what? He only takes gratification. He gets benefit from the body of the woman. He doesn't have a marriage with her. He just enjoys her body like one who just enjoys the sadistic power. It says, Further, I'm Ravua. Hashem says, I'm called holy. If you don't have everything that I have, says Hashem, do not accept for yourself a position of authority. Continues the Ramchal, they taught us in Harius, they needed positions, they needed to take a job, they had no money, what should they do? So they needed to become a Rebbe, a Rav, and whatnot. But still, they didn't want to accept upon the self position of authority. This is what the Chachamim taught us. Do you think I'm offering you a position of authority? No, when you get that position of authority, it's really servitude. Continues, Rav Gamliel. Oy la le rabbana, is shem ikaberis, as bayi lawo, it's to the rabbana, it buries its holders. And we know, and I've heard of you know this, mi yosef ha tzadik, al gemar and brachos, shem nei shem ani gatzmuk, where rabbana is because he acted in a way of authority, mi is kaidim echad, he died before his brothers. Kla lo yishal davar, says the Ramchal, is always summing up the matter. Ein ha rabbana, zela masa gadol. The rabbana, authority is what? It's a heavy burden. I shall shechem and noisy oisai on the shoulders of those who carry it. Kiach adam yachad v'yeshiv zechamai. Person is a singular person dwelling amongst his people. Movla bin anashem. He's undistinguished from everyone else. Einoi nitbas el alatzmai. Who is he accountable for? Himself. Kivishen is alur rabbanus who sharab when he comes up to position again. It doesn't just mean rabbanus. It means a position of authority, the head of something, the name, the big, the 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 flair. Kavaru nitbas like homash dachas yadum and shalta. Then he's accountable for whom? Not just himself, for all the people that he's in charge of. Kiyolav lahachkev al kulam for his responsibility to monitor all of them. Will raise a some day of his eschel to guide them in the correct understanding and knowledge. Will yasher my say and correct their actions. So again, it is talking about someone of authority. Let me just correct myself. It doesn't just mean the head of an organization. Authority to control people. A rebbe, a rav. Someone who's supposed to be helping the people, so now he's responsible for them. Vim lav, and if he doesn't do this, their iniquity, their sin will be on their heads. Ksiv amru chachamim. That's what the chachamim teach us. And finally, concludes Ramchal for today. He keeps telling us to run away from kavod. He says, "What's kavod? 
Hevel avalim, futility of futilities. Amavir adam al daitai. Cause a person to act against his better judgment. Valdas kane against Hashem. Umishachai al chavasai and forgets all his obligations. Umishem akirai. One who recognizes such, one who realizes the burden, one who realizes the obligation. What's he going to do? He's going to find the covenant repulsive and he's going to hate it. And people praise him for it? No, he doesn't want the praises. It's considered a burden to him. When he sees them, praising him too much for things he doesn't really have, which of course is going to happen to a person of authority in a position. He's embarrassed and pains. As he feels he doesn't have, it's a misfortune, it's a chaser, he's lacking the good qualities. They're praising him and praising him, but he's like, it's not me. So why are they doing it? It just causes him further humiliation. With the incredible power, we have to realize the hevel avolim, that sometimes things could perceive, it could be one might think they are kavod. We'll pick it up from here in the next year.